everyone. Um, just wanted to do a quick tag video response to Corey when he was answering the 20 questions from you to move this. Okay, perfect. From the 20 questions from Mally, um, he said it was Mally 61 or 61605. So Mally from Corey. I saw this in um, Corey's uh, Ballerina Boys video response. And she wanted to be tagged in her videos for asking 20 questions. So the first one, the craziest place you've had sex. So in case there's spies in my channel from family members, I'm going to hypothetically <laughs> say um, the craziest place that I've had sex, hypothetically, would have been in a hot tub. I know, boring, huh? With a hypothetical boyfriend whose initial hypothetically starts with the letter M. Yeah. Yeah, not that exciting. Kind of boring. Favorite movie. Okay, my favorite childhood movie has to be Princess Bride. Oh my god, I absolutely love it. Princess Buttercup. <laughs> and as you wish. Oh. Favorite crystal. Okay, of course I love all the crystals, but <clears throat> I have to say that my favorite crystal has to be, it's not my birthstone, which is sapphire. I'm a September baby. Here you go if you don't know me. And um, it's not that one. I mean, I do like it, but I resonate a lot with I don't know if you can see this. My Ami Amethyst. Love Ami. They're my favorite crystals. Shoe size. I'm not going to show my feet. Not a good idea. But I am a six, six and a half. Um, hmm. Interesting. I'm going to try to see how I can answer this one. Because I am a little bit of a slob. I think that's just like my, not my dirtiest. I'm just messy. I show you, but I'm embarrassed. So I'm, worst habit is not dirty per se, it's messy. So I'm messy. That, that could be fair. Hmm. My favorite features of someone I like. Hmm. Well, a guy has to be, you know, pretty blonde. I, well, I do kind of like the Mediterranean, and they pretty much have high cheekbones. Pretty tall and handsome. They have olive skin or a little tan. I like diamond-shaped eyes, but nice, bright. Hmm. Robert Downey Jr kind of person Woo! Johnny Depp okay <laughs> needless to say um those are my kind of features that I like I admire in women I love high cheekbones also but I also like a square face like um Salma Hayek I absolutely think that Sofia Vergara is stunning if I can reincarnate it would be Sofia Vergara or Sofia Lauren when she was younger. Mm -hmm. Totally. And who would I turn gay for? Hmm. <laughs> That's a hard one. They're stunning women, but just because they're beautiful doesn't mean that I would become gay. Who would tempt me to become gay? It has that, you know, vibe that, you know, would. Um, hmm. Angelina Jolie. And hmm. probably hmm. 
probably Angelina Jolie or oh god she's funny <laughs> who else would make me I don't know I can think of I, I'd be fair and say Salma Hayek top two um what else let me ooh, erase it um what else oh people um things that i hate that people do in the market or just in general mm. takes me all pet piv napoleon okay i I have to admit that I have a Napoleon complex, totally, because I'm like, people like to say I'm 4'11", but I'm shy of 5, so, damn it, I'm 5. So, I'm, I'm a shorty, and I hate when people don't see me because they're, you know, they have a, you know, this is my view, that's their view, they bump me all the time, bam, they ram into me, <clears throat> hate it. Like, they never, they never, you know, ah, I'm always getting bumped because I'm short. It's not fair. Ah, hate that. Also, from I'm from New York, and I hate it when people, the cashiers, take the time. Oh, I use my phone as an example. Nick, check out. <laughs> it's like, come on, people, chop, chop, swing. We got places to go. Hate that. And so those are the top two things that I hate. One is due to the fact that I lived in New York. And the other one is because I'm short. Describe your undies. Hold on. So these, these are Vickies. They're great, but in the back, they say, kiss me. <laughs> yeah. All right. Well, that one has a story. A friend of mine, <laughs> needless to say, he had a puppy crush on me, and he got that coupon from either another ex, like not, not me, but an ex or his sister, and he gave me a coupon to get the TND <laughs> for free, and I, I got it. <laughs> My favorite alcoholic drink. Not that I'm lush, but I love my Amarillo Sours and I'm a wine now, so any wine. I even like the two buck chunk. Love it. What else, people? Although my favorite, 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 favorite wine is, sorry guys. I will have to take this. Mm -hmm. I'll be right back. Yeah. 
Yeah, you know, I'm, I would go back to my doctor. Yeah. You know, the good thing is there was an SUV one. And because of the whole, the, the, the other car was a front of the whole car, the front of the car goes all the way in the back of the other car. Not like it didn't touch my back seat, but it completely destroyed that. So if there was a, if there was a sedan, <laughs> I wouldn't be next to me. And luckily, the two sedan passengers were okay too because I, I think the engine helped out a lot. The engine, they, we all came out without scratches, but those cars were so. Yeah. yeah, they truly did not. Oh no, thank you. <laughs> Oh, thank you. No, yeah, I'll keep you posted. I know. So far, so good. I've been sitting, now I was laying down and sitting on a cold top. Oh, my Lord. It's, yeah, I know, taking a used to. Yeah, so I'm just like reading and. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. No, I told, I told um, Jenny that I was going to be for the baby hair. <laughs> no, no, it's not it's not that bad. It, it's not that bad. Just the lifting is what I need to be a little bit more careful. Yeah. But uh, we'll do thank you for checking. <laughs> oh no no no, I was fine. I was fine, I'm totally Right now, uh, my friends stare at me and say, Oh, you don't see that now. You probably see that with your nose or two. I'm like, No, don't stare at me. Yeah, we, we, we all exchange gifts and it's just like, Yeah, he's, he, the, I have a talk to the other people and they have mine. So, yeah, um, I've been doing a little bit of cat cows to help me too. Cat cows? Because it, uh, what it feels, it feels like, um, like if I lifted something and kind of like it's tender. Not not that I find it, but kind of tender. So what I'm trying to do is just not make it like hurt. Because it doesn't hurt, it just feels tender. So when it, yeah, I was very happy to know that. <laughs> yeah. But that, that's just the lower back seat. The neck feels much better because I'm doing stretches when I can and I'm putting a nice back in the neck too, a little bit just in case I get really in it. A bit rash. But so far, so good. The first, the mo I didn't work the next round. The next day, she didn't cut off early, luckily. I did feel dizzy right when I woke up. But then after I ate and I took the Avalon, I felt much, much better. And I haven't had any dizzy spells since. So yeah, but I think it was because I was kind of groggy. No, yeah, no, my mom, my mom is around here because she knows that, you know, she could come and get me and, and help me out. But thank you so much for checking me. <laughs> okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay, guys, so sorry. I didn't want to turn it off either because, um, oh my god, but it's getting long. Ugh. So sorry. I'll make, I'll make it quick. Okay. Um, what happened is that we got in our accident, but I'll tell you guys later. So what did, what did I eat for breakfast? A parfait from this cat French cafe. So it wasn't a McDonald's one. Strawberries, blueberries, and the yogurt with a um with a soy latte for no when it comes to that oh car i don't have a car i live in san francisco so i i uh bus or taking i would take taxi um you know if um if i need a drive bar i sorry i just um you know rent rent a car 
my dream car hmm, my dream car though it's an Audi GT or um pretty much that's what I like I like the Audi GT or any um or any Vokes um, I don't know I was gonna see if that's what I mean. Audi GT let's put it that way Forge Lexus <laughs> Audi GT um but I probably would get a hybrid um you know like a pre well, like you know like a I think they sell sedans that are hybrids and that they they're not Prius but but you know something to help the environment but I do love the Audi GT anyway money in my wallet lucky today I probably only have like probably have fifteen dollars I usually don't don't carry that much tea or coffee both as you can tell I love my lattes but I also love my Earl Grey my chamomile tea jasmine tea I love teas and coffee but I tend to be really in the middle like towards the evening I have teas in the morning I have one cup of coffee and then the rest day is teas but I love both worst TV shows oh my god and this one I have to agree with Corey about the kids wearing makeup and you know something tiaras I don't even know the name and I also hate this other um, show in Bravo about a dance company I forgot the name of the lady too but any show that like um, what's the word <clears throat> exploits Ugh. the problem about knowing a lot of languages is that you don't remember words in different in different languages so exploit children I like some reality shows others not so much so it's not that those are the shows that I really can't stand the ones that exploit the kids for reals mm. I, I you know I'm um, I don't look blonde because I'm brunette, but you can if you were in person you could see that I'm that have little you know, you can't really see it but I have like I have like the baby hairs are kind of blonde I'm I'm really blonde I'm really an airhead <laughs> so I I watch TV um, my favorite shows are I watch Grey's Anatomy. I watch a lot of the ones from USA, Covert Affair. I'm recording. Mm. Fashion Star, I'm totally digging right now. Um, another top that I record. What's up on a time? Guilty pressure number one. Modern family. <gasps> and one that's like with one that started with James Vandervig. Don't trust don't trust the the bitch from from apartment twenty three or something like that with um James Vandervig. <laughs> this is a good show too. And guilty pleasures like everyone hates it, but I love it. Cousin Girl and Vampire Diaries. Ah, Nikita. Okay, but definitely, definitely, I love TV. Mm -hmm. Yep, 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 yep. I love TV. Favorite clothing item. I don't like the Kardashians, but I kind of like their, some of their style, especially Courtney. 
I don't want to move any more. So, ah! I have. I'm starting to get these kind of shirts to wear with my skinny jeans or whatnot. I'll put it here. But, so this is for one of my friend's birthdays that I'm going to wear. And I'm going to wear a belt with it. I know it's not much, but... I tend to be more more soccer mom because I am a teacher, so a lot of my like going like when I go out is more to like a wedding or like if, if I go clubbing. I have a couple of dresses like this, but this is my favorite right now. Then this one has got me a lot of free drinks. <laughs> But my favorite, favorite, are these shoes that I just bought. Uh, the, ugh, I'm so bad. When am I going to learn how to, uh, ugh. Okay, so these are Donna Karens that I got at a, a I'll say a vintage store. Um, they sell new and old items. Here in the city, it's called um, Crossroads. I don't know if you guys know it. I don't know if they have it in another city or in another state, but we have these in, in uh, San Francisco. And they're from Donna Karen. They are to die for. So yeah, that's about it for the clothes. I have a bunch of jewelry, but you know, I make jewelry, so it's too much to show. Ate for dinner. I haven't eaten dinner, but I'm thinking of doing a avocado salad, with tomatoes. I'll leave mm -hmm. vanilla yogurt. Perhaps wine. Hmm. And if you would chimichanga with anyone, who would it be? <laughs> Your ears only. I would totally chimichanga with. No contest. Robert Downey Jr. <laughs> There's so many hot guys. It's too many to choose. So I'd go for the one that always hits the spot. Robert Downey Jr. And. Uh, Okay, so I want to real life. I know one person who's going to see this video and might be able to tell him. But she knows I'll kill her. She does. It's her co worker, so I don't need to say names. It's hot. Okay, favorite herb. Um, I added that one because for some reason I only got 19 questions from Corey. I know I must have missed so many. I eat a lot of cilantro, but that's just in the tummy. <laughs> Magically, I love rosemary and parsley and sage. You know, sacred circle with the sage. A little love and protection with the rosemary. I mean, parsley and the rosemary, you know. Love and protection. Pretty much it. Yep. And yeah, guys. Um, I wanted to do um, one of my last videos for my series, which I did, but I haven't posted. Um, with my week with the elements. I do a spell a day with um, each element. I think if you see my channel, you'll see it, but I haven't posted one, two, actually, that I've done already. And then I got into that car accident, and I am going way too long. Sorry, guys. But um, it was a pretty big accident, but I'm doing okay. I just feel some tenderness. 
So I'm trying not to take some uh, medication just so I can really see how badly I'm injured. But so far I'm holding up, thank God. Um, yeah. That's all, folks. Enjoy. Hopefully you guys don't get too bored. And bless it be. Yay, I don't know how to cook that.